Oh, there's cheese. Oh, yes. It's 445 this one. Ooh, that's good. What's up, guys? And welcome back to another episode of the $5 Bite. On today's episode, we are in the north side of Houston, just northwest of downtown, and we are gonna check out a Mexican bakery called El Bolillo Bakery. They've been around since the late 90s. They've grown to an exponential size, and the city loves them. So, this place is located just across from a farmer's market. They serve up what is called bolillos which are like a baguette style pastry or bread and they are something that came from european influence it was actually interesting I, I i did a little research about the bolillo and it is a baguette that was brought by chefs from the emperor of mexico during the 1800s like 1860s the emperor was actually Austrian so that was pretty cool if you like history take a look at that it's a little history lesson to learn about the history of the bolillo on top of bolillos they actually have a lot of cool pastries pan breads they also do tres leches they do amazing cakes as well so I've been here before with Sandy before we film videos this place is a gem in the city it has been known to be one of the best bakeries in the US as well as one of the best bakeries in Houston so you got to check this place out the airline location is their main location it is across from the farmers market there's a newly renovated farmers market to my left here El Bolillo is on my right but we're gonna go in there we're gonna see what I can get for you know it five dollars we're gonna eat good I'm pretty sure so let's go inside and check it out <laughs> I wanted to um, see what, I've got a budget of $5 total. What would you recommend I get? Bread? Yeah, anything. anything. Your best seller or whatever you have that you would recommend. I recommend, um, I would like the sweet, 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 sweet uh, bread. Okay. So, uh, maranitos. Maranitos? Ears. Ears, right here? Orejas. Pues. Orejas, okay. Almohadas, it's uh, something inside, cream cheese inside. Almohadas, okay. Okay, this is one dollar. One dollar, okay. Uh, six, uh, 65 cents. Six 65 like cents, okay. Empanadas. Empanadas. Guava, more empanadas over there. Okay. We have sweet potato, pumpkin, okay. uh, pineapple. Oh, wow. Uh, everything is <laughs> and And bolillo, it's like the bread, right? Like the yes. French style bread? Cheese and jalapeno. Oh, there's cheese? Oh. Uh, How much are the. 75 cents. The, the small one is 25 cents. Smallest 25 cents? It's uh, 35 cents. 35 cents. Oh, wow. And then those are the jalapeno? Uh huh. Oh, wow. They're sweet empanadas, right? Not like there's no meat in them? No. Okay. We have, uh, Banana, Banana, nuts. Awesome. Oh, no. And how much are these? This one is one dollar. One dollar, and these and are sixty-five cents. Sixty-five cents. Okay. And seventy-five cents. Seventy-five cents. So you get the tray like yes. that? Yes. Over there. Perfect. Let me put this. If you need something, you let me know. Okay? okay. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And and on this side, what are these over here? Cream cheese, okay, croissant. Oh, the regular croissant, okay. This bread is not too much sweet. Cream cheese, okay. And this one is cream cheese inside. Cream cheese. This one is pineapple inside. Pineapple, okay. What do you call these? I've seen them before. I did, I just wasn't sure the name. The name? This one is plumillas. Plumillas, okay. Cuerno de queso. Cuerno de queso. Cuerno de queso, okay. 
Semita. Semita, okay. Conjoli. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, sorry, one more time. Sesame seed is a uh, uh, conjoli. Okay, sesame uh -huh. seed, okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This one mm -hmm. is good. That one is, is canastas. Canastas, in, okay. In English, it's a basket. Okay. Bigotes is mustache. Oh, okay. This <laughs> girlfriend. Okay. Novia. Awesome. <laughs> novias, novias. <laughs> yes, it's 95 cents. 95 uh -huh. cents. Okay. Do you have a menu to see the pricing or just oh, grab? We have the menu with the five dollar budget. I let you choose for me. Just I just want one bolillo just to try the bolillo maybe with the jalape uh -huh. menu. You think okay. that one is the best? Just want I want to try that one plus whatever else you think. Okay. But it has to be five dollars or okay. less. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> so one of this, this one? Uh -huh. cuerno de queso. Cuerno okay. De queso. Okay. It's a caracoles. 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 Okay. I know you told me all this. It's just okay. <laughs> it's difficult. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let me grab one of these. Caracoles. That one. What is mm -hmm. the? Is that the apple inside? Apple. No, With that one is cream cheese. Uh, cream cheese. Apple. And then you guys make fresh tortillas over here. Yes. This is fresh uh -huh. tortillas. Oh wow. Yes. Okay. Corn flour. Only only flour. Only flour. Okay. Only flour. Good to know. <laughs> yes. Something else? No. Total under yes. five. It's four forty-five this one. Ooh, that's good. That's awesome. Thank okay. you so much. I appreciate it. No, we're good. What was your name? Christina. Christina, nice, nice to, meet to meet you. Thank you so much, Christina. I'm Sean. Okay. So I pay over here. Awesome. Thank you so much, Christina. Thank you. Hola. Five forty-five or four forty-five? Five. Five. Oh, Christina. <laughs> she said it's five forty-five. This one is ojo. Okay. She said five forty-five on the five dollars. No, four forty-five. Four forty-five. <laughs> okay. No problem. Thank you. <laughs> Alright guys, I've got my El Bolillo bakery items here. They were super nice. Christina really showed me everything. It is raining cats and dogs and I saw her running people outside with an umbrella. Customer service at this place is second to none. The one thing I will say is it's a little confusing with the pricings. They did have a price sheet on the door. It's really small. So I just would say you know that's one thing i noticed with a lot of bakeries is price you know it'd be it's so nice to know like a picture with a price and a name i mean obviously christina's doing an amazing job the staff in there were like super efficient you know as far as that goes it's just you don't know what your your cost is going to be at the end sometimes she gave me a few extra items she insisted we went back and forth and i think she wanted me to try them as far as customer service goes this place is awesome i'm looking forward to trying this out i definitely probably got more than the five dollars uh, would have bought me but they are super nice like they're very helpful they were like don't worry about the price and I was like no it's for a challenge it has to be five dollars it's not about the money it's just about you know making sure that we show the viewers that we have a five dollar budget and we meet that but with that said let's get into this food let me grab the tray first have it over here as usual and it is raining cats and dogs right now outside like it's bad i don't know what's going on in houston but i've got my tray i'm dry we have a few different items well first off we have the bolillo which is the name of the place it's still warm and this one it has jalapeno in it this is awesome it's like a mini baguette 75 cents for this one had to try it out. You can get the plain ones for like 35 cents, which is amazing. Oh, and it's soft on the sides. If, you, if you've never had a Bolillo, they have like these markings on the top. I think that's to vent it so the air can come through and it doesn't just, you know, break this nice golden crisp outer shell. Here we go. Oh, there's cheese. Oh, yes. Look at that cheese, yo. It's like jalapeno on fresh bread. <laughs> this is awesome 75 cents man it's so fresh this is just what i needed folks look at that goodness in there i think i could have probably gotten five or six of these with a five dollar budget i've never tried the bolillo in the past when i've been here but obviously because of the name it's a must and get the jalapeno one i think the plain ones are probably not bad they're more probably for like sandwich making the fresh sandwich bread awesome this is this is awesome man this is Oh, I'm at a loss of words right now. <laughs> now we have this little croissant looking pastry. Look how big these things are. This is nuts. Now she said this one's a little sweet. 
I'm gonna put the name at the bottom because honestly I don't remember all the names. She showed me so many different things. Break this bad boy up. That smells so good. And... Oh, oh man. It's like cream cheese I think inside. And again, I, I apologize these names. I, I, I don't speak Spanish fluently. I wish I did and I hope one day I do. Sandy does speak Spanish, by the way. That ain't gonna stop me from eating this. This is good. And I apologize, it is raining hard. Like, so if you hear this and it's hard to hear me, apologies. All right, let's bite into this thing. Very sweet, cream cheese. Starbucks used to have these cream cheese pastries and this is just a better version of it. Obviously I can't eat all of this, so I'm taking some back for Sandy. I'm gonna leave her this half, but this is outstanding again. This time I ate the salty, item first which is that bolillo with the jalapeno cheese and <laughs> now we're going to the sweet mm. before we go further i have my water bottle here you gotta keep hydrated folks really really important the food is great here the customer service was outstanding i'm a happy camper right now I haven't even gotten through all these items all right the next one i'm just gonna show you the different items i've got here this one I think she said had cream cheese on it. It's like a muffin looking style. And then I think this was like a conch. I'm not sure exactly. Also looks great. She threw in one more item when I was paying. She kind of just threw this one in there. Let me know if you know what this one's called, but super nice of them. They did not have to do this. I just was coming in to spend five bucks and show you guys, but whew look at that oh man this is gonna be fun sandy's gonna have leftovers today i can't eat all this let's do this one first whoa huge lightning strike in front of me sorry guys i'm kind of nervous but oh this is nice it's like a cake on the bottom of it and it's like a cinnamon bun almost on the side i'm gonna take a bite out of the whole thing just to kind of get the whole experience if i'm doing this wrong let me know in the comment section below three two and I love what they do with the textures here. Crunchy on the outside here. Savory, soft, spongy kind of cake. Very moist in the in the center. I like it. It's just cake. But they one-upped it with this outer shell here on the sides to give you that nice crunch. Let me know if you know the name of this. I, I have no idea. She just snuck this one in the bag. I've got a little bit of a mess here, but I'm enjoying it. Totally worth it. I'm gonna do it with the muffin looking one here. And I know she told me the names of these. This one has cream cheese as well. It's like a cream cheese muffin, sugar on top. The quality of this place is solid. It's a little bit of sugar for me, but it's all about portion control, right? That's what I like about the $5 bite. But they're solid items, solid. This place is good. We're at the last item. Oh, it smells so heavenly. I'm not even kidding. And this one's like a Danish. None of their pastries are like dry. I've always had little baguettes in the grocery stores and they get dry. That bolillo was really, really good. Really fresh. It had a crisp feel to it. And that cream cheese with the jalapeno inside. Oh, outstanding. It's like sugared stuff on the outside. I like it though. These pastries, they look really beautiful. You know, they're not just bread, you know. They have a little bit of a color to them different shapes and sizes. Everything in there is fresh. You can smell it. You can smell the bakery in your car. That's how fresh this place is. As soon as you walk in, it's like overbearing a little bit in a good way. I'm gonna take another bite here and then I'm gonna save the rest for Sandy because I am already full. El Bolillo, you get a thumbs up. You get a double thumbs up from me. Come check this place out. They are outstanding. Customer service here is amazing as well. And there's this farmer's market. We definitely got to check that out and make a video here. With that said, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing, it's totally free. If you're enjoying this challenge, please share it with a friend. Let more people know about these $5 spots. I have a ton of videos on the $5 bite. We have a playlist on our channel page, so be sure to check the playlists out. If you know of places that are $5 or less and have good food, let me know in the comments and you can see that video on one of these episodes. But with that said, we'll see you on the next one. Bye.